theaters when you're buying a house. So people often buy homes that have some kind of home theater system in the house that they're buying. And most people want to make sure that they're going to get the home theater if their intention is to buy those home theater system. Now, there are a few problems that come up all the time in terms of the contracts that are put together for buying a home when there's a home theater involved. So there are some components that are built in. The speakers are the biggest one. If there's a built-in screen or built-in projectors or things like that, those are things that are built in. And if it's built in, it's considered a fixture, which means that you should get it as part of the contract. Now, there are also other components that are not built in. The receivers, the little boxes, whether it's a, a receiver for, for music or to project it to all the different speakers in your home, there's going to be equipment that just sits on a shelf somewhere with wires attached to it and plugs in that aren't built in. That makes them a chattel. And a chattel is not included in most purchase contracts unless you specifically write it in. Now, my view, write the whole thing into the contract. Make sure there's no ambiguity. Make sure that you know exactly what you're getting. So when you move in and want to watch that movie or listen to your favorite music, it's all there ready for you. That's another Kahane Law Legal Minute. Thank you for watching. Don't forget, like our video, share our video, and don't forget to subscribe to our channel.